I'm sure a lot of NBA fans out there are thinking the same question that I am going to be asking today. What happened to the two-time All-Star Roy Hibbert who at one point was one of the most feared shot blockers in the NBA? He dominated the paint for the Indiana Pacers for years. But just five years after Hibbert had a clutch block on Carmelo Anthony in the playoffs, he suddenly disappeared out of the league at just 31 years old. Why is that and how does that happen? Well, it's actually not as confusing as you may think it is. But before I explain why Roy Hibbert essentially retired at the age of 31, be sure to drop a like on the video and hit that sub button so you don't miss out on any of my future content. Roy Hibbert was a 7'2", 280 pound center out of Georgetown who played with the Indiana Pacers from 2008 to 2015. And while he was on the Pacers, not only did he play a huge role in the 2014 Miami playoff series, but he averaged 12 points, 9 boards, and just over 2 blocks for almost a decade with the Pacers. However, when he was just 28 years old, he made his way to the Los Angeles Lakers, and that's when it went downhill for Roy Hibbert. In an interview, David West said whenever Roy was traded to the Western Conference, that's when the tides turned for Roy. He said at the time, the center position in the West was way different than what it was in the East. And that makes sense because if you fast forward to the present day, you have players like Tristan Thompson who are only 30 years old, finding it hard to find a team. And obviously Tristan Thompson had a very similar play style to Roy Hibbert. And even after the subpar year with the Lakers, Roy Hibbert went back to the Eastern Conference to play with the Hornets. At the Hornets, he wasn't that bad and showed flashes of the old Roy Hibbert, but he just never found his footing. The play style for the center in the NBA has changed so much and Roy Hibbert just couldn't adapt. Even his former coach Frank Vogel said the league moved in the opposite direction of Hibbert's playstyle. He also said he thinks that Roy could still be in the league today if he would have tried to adapt but it just seemed like he never made that effort. So to answer the ultimate question on why Roy Hibbert was out of the league at just the age of 31, it's basically due to the fact that he got traded away from the Pacers and could never fit in after that. It makes you wonder though, if he would have stayed on the Pacers, would Roy still be in the league today or at least had a few more years in the league? Because I gotta say, as a Pacers fan, it was a blast watching Hibbert dominate the paint in 2014. Not only would he be on the highlight reel every once in a while, but he would also just be a solid center to have on your starting lineup. He was a big reason on why the Pacers made that run in 2014 and put up a fight against LeBron's Heat. But that leaves us with the question of where is Roy today? Last I checked, Hibbert is a player development coach with the 76ers, or at least he was as of 2019. It is unclear if he is still with the team today or if he has moved on. If you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to drop a like, subscribe, turn on notifications, spend time with your friends and family, and let me know any other players you want me to make a video about for the future. I appreciate you taking the time to get this far in the video, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.